Okay, so today we are going to talk about conditional sentences. First of all, here I have mentioned the ways how can you write conditional. So you have got two methods to write conditional. If you are going to write your if class first, then you have to write if class, comma, and main class, or we can also call it as result class. In case if you are going to write your result class first, then just simply you have to write your result class, no comma in between, and then your if class. For example, if you come, comma, I will teach you. This is the first method. If you come, if class, comma, I will teach you the result class. And the second method is, I will teach you if you come, full stop. So this was the method that how we write conditionals. And uh, number second is, here you have to understand that word is conditional. Basically, whenever we talk about conditional class, it means we have got two classes. Here we are talking about two things. Number one is the condition and number second is the consequence or the result. So this result actually depends upon the condition and we have given a certain specific condition that if the condition is fulfilled, this is the result. This will be the result. This is what going to be the result of that condition if that is fulfilled or not. So the result will be accordingly. So here that's why we talk about two things, the condition and the result. Therefore, the class in which the condition is written we call it if class and the class where the result is written we call it as result class or main class why do we call it main class because in case if you separate it with uh, if you separate it from the uh, if class still it is going to give you the complete sense as i said if you come i will teach you here if i eradicate if you come and i just say i will teach you so still it is going to give you the complete sense that's why if i remove if i teach you sorry if you come and i just say i will teach you so this i will teach you is a complete sentence and each complete sentence is called a main clause uh, and your if class is your dependent class because it depends upon the main class we have uh, fourth uh, uh, we have different types of conditional zero conditional first conditional second conditional third conditional and mixed conditional if we talk about zero conditional so here we talk about those sections in which you are 100 percent sure that if your condition is fulfilled the result is going to be true 100 percent there is no exceptions means whenever the condition is fulfilled the result is true so it most of the time happens in scientific reactions there you are confirmed that if your condition is fulfilled your result will be true how like i say if ice melts it becomes water now this is something that always going to that is always going to happen whenever ice melts it becomes water so you just can say when if if ice melts comma it becomes water the second example i have which, uh, which i have written here is if you add a 20 and 30 it becomes 50 again always the result is going to be the true 100 percent if you add 20 and 30 it becomes 50 so in these type of actions for these type of actions we use a zero conditional and the formula for zero conditional is this uh, in the if class you are going to write present simple and the main class you are going to write present simple and then we have got first conditional or we call it uh, conditional type one or real conditional as well here we talk about the real situation that if your condition is fulfilled the result is going to be seen in reality the result is going to be the real in future how like i say if you the same example which i just gave that if you come i will teach you so this is something which is going to be well as we know that will predicts about the future about the scenario that is going to come it means it can be in reality it can be well that is why if you come i will teach you so here the first the if class is going to be in present simple and the main class and or the result class is going to be with the model auxiliary will that talks about the prediction or possibility of any action which depends upon the condition i say if i teach you you will learn this so what is the condition if i teach you what will be the result you will learn this this is how you make zero conditional and first conditional